All right, today I'm going to make a, a video response to uh, Pinewood CH uh, 2000 subscriber challenge, and uh, congratulations on uh, reaching the 2000 subscribers. And I guess you're going well past that there now. And his challenge is to make a shelter using your bare hands with no tools. And obviously take into certain other considerations, but uh, I'm going to make a lean-to shelter and uh, we'll see how it goes, I guess. Okay, this is the kind of area that I'm in. And I, I just walked in through that way. And I'm just going to make some kind of shelter in around here somewhere. So I guess we'll see how it goes, I guess. Crap. Now I was hoping that he'd break off up around here somewhere, but that's it I guess. Save all the bells.
uh, you just want to pace yourself at this. You'd want to get sweating too hard. So pretty much just take your time. Buck them over, find the weak spot, and then push back that way in, and you should be able to snap them right off. Now, uh, I know that I'm uh, killing a lot of trees, but uh, later on I'm going to set some rabbit snares, and I'll just break off a few limbs and I'll use those for catching rabbits. Anyway.
try to use the stuff that's handy to you. You haven't got to go too far. You haven't got to.
I also want to get some limbs now to make a mattress. All right, for the flooring, I got these bell tops, got these bells, and we just stick them in like that. It'll take a little while, but it really makes it comfortable because you really want to get your, protect yourself from uh, the floor, the cold and moisture. I don't know how well you can see that, but it's going to be a real nice mattress when it's all done. I want to show you this now because my battery is getting a little bit low and uh, if the battery goes dead I'll bring her to the truck and, and recharge her but I'll just continue on with this. I won't do nothing that, uh, that you would need tools for. So I'll just... It's a little more comfortable doing this than if you just threw the bells in there. Just look at the mattress you're going to have there. Oof. Obviously they'll flatten down a bit overnight, but, but still you want, a, you want a lot of protection on the floor. So anyway, I'm going to get some more bells and uh, continue on with the flooring. All right, I haven't got the, the bedding done yet, but I just want to show you how high that is. So, you know, that's a, that's a nice thick mattress that's going to be there. I'm going to come on out here, and I'll show you on the back here too now. And every now and then I keep adding a few limbs on back and try to make that pretty thick, you know, really keep the heat in there. And you could even bank it up down the line there with snow if you wanted to, I guess. But anyway, I'm gonna get some more limbs going top up here. I wanna make the top a little heavier in that so in case we get snow or something and, and I'm gonna continue on with the flooring for now and uh, I gotta turn the camera off again now the battery is pretty low. Ooh, a comfy mattress. Oh man, oh boy. Without any tools, it takes a nice bit of work all the same, but uh, you just gotta pace yourself. And I don't have an air fire lit, but if you had a nice big fire, All right, I'm uh, heading back there now. The camera went dead there, but uh, what I was saying was, uh, well, uh, as you're collecting uh, sticks and bells and stuff to build your house, if you see any uh, good firewood, it's good to 
you clicked up a bit of firewood too because you're going to need quite a bit for sure you want a, you want a real big fire going there and uh, I started off as a lean-to but it looks more like a, a bow house or at least a cross between a bow house and a, and a lean-to but that's sufficient to get you through the night for sure and uh, if you had to the next day you could always add to it or whatnot and uh, you might have a plan in your mind you know when you're building the house but uh, you're going to be limited what you could do with just your hands so so you have to make adjustments as you go along for sure so i hope that's uh, sufficient for the, the contest and again i'd like to congratulate the pinewood ch on passing these uh, 2000 subscribers and uh, i really enjoyed uh, doing this uh, vid uh, i really like the challenge and uh, thank you uh, for giving me the opportunity and uh, cheers from labrador the big land